whole bunch and get super pissed about it when I know what I'm signing up for. That's what it's time for. I believe in Sora. I'll never get over the fat Riku hashtag to himself. Beans can't make jack shit. Hi, JV. I'm doing okay. I uh, am feeling a little pressed because I I realized how close the 20th is, and I'm like, oh, I want these trophies. How are you? It's been a while. I haven't done Kingdom Hearts in a long time. I hope you're doing well. I thought he did 
did it four times! What? Did I miscount? I miscounted big time. Oh fuck, I'm out of high potions! Okay. I'm just like... No, I'm not even gonna... I didn't realize I was out of high hearts. Nope. It's not worth it. Trophies. Hey Pat, how are you? Okay. I, I did not realize I was out of five pots. That was bad. How are you, Pet? It's been a while. Well, it's been a while since I've done Kingdom Hearts. I've been doing stuff on and off, like Genshin and Scarlet Nexus. But how are you? Mm. Oh no, JV, you got COVID. I'm so sorry. I'm glad you're able to go back to work. Are you okay? Like, I hope it wasn't... I mean, obviously, if you're going back to work, like, you're okay enough by America's standards, but, like, are you okay? Like, good. I'm, I'm glad. Um. I can't believe I only had two high pots on me. What's wrong with me? working working on some projects. What kind of projects are you working on this year? Okay, I'm so happy for you, JV, honestly. You know what? I don't even have... I'm a fucking fool. Excuse me. Increase cuisine stat bonuses by 25%. Ah. Okay, I'll take it. Sonic and Sega Fan Jam. Oh, nice! In Atlanta. Oh my god, that's gonna be so much. This is gonna be so big. That's exciting. And some other stuff you can't talk about. Ooh, secrets. Okay, alright. I see you, Pat. I see you. I got greedy. Ooh. What did I do? Oh, fuck. Yeah. 
on the, the dodges on those blue lasers. Ah. I'm scared. Poor 
we try? Oh, thank you, Mako. Hi, Mako. This first one? Yeah. Oh! Koopo coin before the next DM. I should be fine. And of course, I fucking panic. 
Are you fighting him with pro codes too, Moko? <sighs> I hate everything. I was gonna get him. way too early and I was about to panic. So I can skip the first blue lasers. I can dodge the first blue lasers in the last phase. But it, apparently I have a problem dodging the second blue lasers on the last phase. So I'm getting there. I'm getting closer. Oh, uh, what was your favorite secret boss, Mocha, for Cage one I really like Kurt Ziza. I think I'll always like Kurt Ziza because it's named after... Excuse me. It's named after a kid that, like, submitted. So I think I'll always like that fight. But I just think it's, like, well-designed. No, 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 I forgot about that wall. Like, how he has all the extra walls at the very, very end after a second DM. I forgot about it. And I didn't come out of the stun anyway, so it's not like I would have been able to do anything. But if I had, like, they were all around me and I forgot about them. But who's your favorite secret boss? No, not we're going to build. I forgot about the walls. Take 
think of the uh, Zemnus fight at the end of KH1. Fuck. Or the... So, okay, I'm sorry. I, the other bosses are super bosses, so like Sephiroth and Kurt Zizo would actually be a super boss. I'm sorry, I was mistaken. Um, what did you think of the secret fight of uh, the unknown at um, in Hollow Bastion? done with his first DM. Like, ever, ever. I can't, I can't. in words how excited I am right now. Oops. 
every time. No more. Shit, 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 shit. Oh. Dan. I hate this game. Okay. I only have 11 more to do, give or take. Uh, I've been learning his fight for two weeks. <laughs> now I have to learn a whole new fight and I'm scared. I'm terrified. <sighs> oh my god. Hell yeah! I can get the weakest hell yeah there is. I cannot be excited. Oh my god, Dan. Everyone. Luke Sword's the only one I did on this file, and it was last year. I've been learning Xemnas for two weeks. Because I haven't played this game since last year. And it's just however many I get until I hit the merit points. So I don't have to do all of them as long as I have enough pro codes on. Um, cause I think the total merit point score that you need is 365,000 for the trophy. Um, and I accidentally did not do any for Armored Xehanort during Remind cause I forgot to turn them back on for Remind. Um, yeah, it's just, I haven't put anything up yet. So I just need to do however many I need to do until- oh my god, I got more for Zimnus than I did for Luxer. Did I suck with Luxer? Am I bad? What? Oh, excuse me. Um, but I just- however many until I get enough. Young Nort's one of the easier fights. Uh, Young Master's A and Art. He- uh, yeah. Young Nort. Young Nort? Is one of the easier But I'm bad at the game, Dan! This one isn't responding yet. Um Okay. I was also trying Marluxia, because I feel like I remember Marluxia being one of the easiest fights. Oh Zigbar, you're so right, actually. You're super right. At the very least, you found it to be easy. Dan, I'm bad at the game. You're not. Luke Cern's the easiest, like, overall. But I feel like Zigbar probably is uh, easy in comparison to, like, the rest of the standard fights. <coughs> uh, Zigbar's scary. Because 
because Luke turns just gimmicks. He's he's like he has a gimmick pattern. Stay away from Lurxing and Syx. So I'm I'm hoping that with as many pro codes as I do have on, because I think I only have two turned off, and it's um, no battle items and no Koopa coin. But all the rest I have turned on. I am hoping with all the pro codes that I have turned on, I will pop the trophy. <coughs> Excuse me. Before. I even have to get to Larxene and Syx. I'm hoping that each fight with the amount of pro codes that I have on gives me enough points that I won't have to do Larxene Syx. And I don't even think I'll end up having to unlock Shion and Master Xehanort. Um, Cause I only have two codes turned off. But, uh, we'll see. Screen shakes are spooky. Right. The hero thinks he's ready now. Back. Whoa! Fuck. Oh, you fucker. Ah, oh, fuck. Whoa, just did it. Oh, fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck! I was doing so well! This one's special! I did it at that. Oh, yeah, 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 okay. I remember. I remember! I forgot. And I didn't put on any more high pots. Because I'm bad. Um. What did I get? I got a new. Does that do anything? That ups my strength. But it lowers my defense. Uh, it's not worth it. Yeah, it only. Mm, yeah, it's not worth it. Um. I'm proud of you too, Moko. I, I was really proud of myself when I did like just the secret bosses themselves, but doing these with pro codes, uh, granted, granted, I'm not doing them on crit, but doing these with pro codes is like a whole different level of panic because there's so much of your utility that you just cannot use. And it's really exciting, but it's like, oh God, I have nothing. Hi, Nick. Time to fight Uncle Zigbar. Yeah. His openings were certainly a trip. I, I feel like I remember this fight distinctly because I had to spend so long on it when I was doing just the regular fights. Um, but obviously it's going to take me a while to kind of get back into the unknown. I feel like because uh, KH3's bosses are built so technically and then the... Which, granted, KH1's... So the unknown is only in Final Mix. He wasn't in like the standard game, so he wasn't built during the standard game. He was built during Final Mix, which was a little bit after. Um, but obviously he was built after Zemnis, because that's who it is. Uh, which was when Kingdom Hearts 2 was built. So it's on the same level, but and then they had to like kind of water it down so that it fit with KH1. But yeah, that's that's a good comparison. Like after spending so much time to learn the technicality of these fights. And then going to Kingdom Hearts 1 or even 2, really, like, for regular, for, like, regular boss fights. Uh, it, it does seem a bit... I just, I guess, less technical. Like, the openings are clearer, I guess. <coughs> Delayed. Defeated Yozora. So, I haven't beaten Yozora legitimately yet because I was getting all the other Remind trophies. So after I get the Pro Codes trophy, I'm gonna go do Yuzora. I did do like the, like the, like with some easy codes, but I haven't sat down and done his full fight because I was doing all of the other Pro Codes and I wanted, and his is the last. Um, and obviously I, I don't have it, so. The points for beating a boss again, just with all the codes. Yeah, I'm not sure. I read something that was like, if you go and redo 
a, a data fight, like it doesn't add your codes together, but if you get a higher score, it will overwrite your score to add to it. But I haven't tried it myself, so I don't know. I could try with Luxor since apparently I got a lower score with Luxor than I did with Xemnas, so I had more codes on for Xemnas. Um, so I guess I could like go back and try Luxor and see if it bumps my score up a little bit, because it wasn't by much. But I read that it will overwrite your score. I just haven't tried it. It does overwrite it. Oh, that's actually so great. I could go back and redo Luke Cert and just get like the little bit. <coughs> Good job, Moko. Um, okay. Bad, stupid me. Uh, of course, I don't have. I don't have ultimate weapon on this file. Of course I don't. Of course I don't. Why would I have ultimate weapon on this file? Why would I make it that much easier for myself? Silly me. So I got, you get points for all of the bosses. Um, <coughs> uh, and then data fights, obviously. It's just depending on how many you have. But, like, the story bosses, obviously, you can't go back and redo, I guess. Maybe, I wonder if I could go redo Armored Xehanort from Remind. I guess I would just have to play through Remind from the beginning on the same file again, right? Because I didn't use, I forgot to turn the pro codes back on when I did his fight. Because I had them off to go through Remind casually. I wonder if I could go back and, re and redo Remind from the beginning. Huh. Uh, I don't think I have it as a separate save, but I think if you choose... I don't have a separate save. But if I choose Remind from the main menu and then I load it on this same file, yeah, I think so. No, you do get points for all of the bosses as long as you have Pro Codes turned on. You get points, but you only get them for boss fights. You don't get them for mob fights. But as long as you have pro codes turned on, you get them for all bosses throughout the game. Base game, Remind, Data Fights, and Yazora. But only boss fights. You have to have them turned on, and you get them for all boss fights. And it's dependent on how many you have turned on is how many points you get. Because each one has the stars, and however many stars you have, it does, like, percentages or whatever. So, like, whenever I did it, I started this one. Um, I didn't want to do all the data fights, and I don't want to do Yazora with Pro Codes, so I did it from the base game, and I went all the way through the base game, all the way to the end, doing all of the boss fights with all Pro Codes. And then when I got to Remind, I forgot to turn them back on, um, so I didn't get any for that. And then with the data fights, because I want to do only a few data fights, but I know I need, like for me personally, I need more of my utility available than the base game. So I only turned off Koopa Coins and um, Battle Items, and I have all the rest turned on, and I'm doing those. It'll probably load me before Xehanort. Oh. oh yeah, Moko, Alice was fine. Like, it was just a nice, quiet, like, little uh, family weekend. It was, like, we stayed one night in a hotel, and we were in a different city for... Just like the two days. I have the goat midnight blue. <laughs> um, okay. I do have midnight blue, but it does, uh, it doesn't do as well as, uh, Oblivion does. New backdrop! New backdrop! Oh, fine. I forgot! I forgot! I forgot! Think fast. Oh fuck! I forgot about it again. Oh fuck! Ah. Oh fuck! Start dancing! Start dancing! No 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 no! Oh! Fuck! Oh, fuck! 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 I forgot! I forgot! I forgot! I forgot! I forgot. Oh fuck! Oh my god, I can't even see! Oh my god. No, 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 I can't run, I can't run! 
Oh fuck. Ah, da 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 da. I'm dead. Oh fuck. Just oh, fuck. I see how it is. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Way too early. Okay, I panicked. Okay. an opening actually Oh, 
<laughs> oh my god. Sir? walking into those things. You better run. Nice. Hey, hey, sir. This one's special. Like um, Phantom Aqua, where she just walks around as bait. saved after Zemnus. I'm an idiot. I'm gonna have to do Zigbar without a coup coupon coin and with only those four high pots. <coughs> I am a big dummy. Good job, Lady Rain. No, skip it. New backdrop. Okay. That's probably an opening too, if I can get to him. Oh, fuck. I did it too early. I got greedy. Thank <laughs> you. 
JV. I promise she is learning.
I, I fucking knew it. It was a bait. This fight is really difficult at first, I know! No dancing today. Whoa. Look at that. New backdrop. Oh, shit. I should wait. I'm the one who dances here. anything I was personally interested in but it was a pretty good direct like objectively there's a lot of stuff for people to look forward to and I'm glad for everything that's coming for all the people who do like it ah fuck <coughs> oh shit I'm sure that's an opening isn't it no no it's a trap it's a fucking trap I should know better ah Oh, that one's an opening. Okay. Okay. Ah! What? What? <laughs> what? Excuse me? Okay. Ah! Shit. Shit. No, I don't want to think that. Yeah. 
Screaming, it's a trap. Naughty Dog announces their new game. Are they working on a new game? <coughs> I thought they were working on um, The Last of Us 2 multiplayer, uh, but then they said they were going to make it standalone. I thought that's what they were working on right now, was the multiplayer Last of Us as like a standalone independent game. Zucumer says no. Hi, Joe. They're working on three. Oh, I see, I see, I see. I don't have any more high pots. What? Ah! I was not prepared. Oh my god. Okay. So what do you say? What do I think? I think you're a bitch. Shit, I did it too early again. A new Jack and Daxter. I'm dead. At like the very next instant, I am dead. Shit. What? Oh, fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. I wasn't prepared. I didn't expect to go into his DM. I thought he was gonna continue his pattern. I thought his DM would come later. I wasn't prepared. No, because I have cure turned off because I'm doing pro codes, Moko. I, the only thing I can use is Koopo coin, which I don't have because I have that pro code, because I don't have that pro code turned on. And um, uh, battle items, because I don't have that pro code turned on. All of the other pro codes are turned on. So my HP and my MP slowly decreases over the course of the fight. Um, they slip. My default stats, not counting gear, not counting food, and not counting boosts, are set to zero. So, like, my level doesn't matter. Um, I can't use form changes. I can't use grand magic. Um, I can't use cure. Uh, I can't use attractions, which I couldn't do anyway. I can't use links, which I couldn't do anyway. Um, I see a few people using... No, I can't use aerial. Oh, wait, the aerial dive sweep. I read that wrong. Not aerial to summon, but aerial dive sweep to get closer. Um, I don't know if I have that one turned on. Because one of the pro codes is you can only have 30 abilities. Or you can only have 30 ability points. So I'm limited on the amount of abilities I can have, too. Because that's one of the pro codes. So, here. So, default status. Um, your whole team stats are returned to their initial default status, regardless of level. Um, zero defense does the same thing. Uh, but strength boost... Uh, a defense boost, um, food, and gear can increase it. Um, HP and MP sleep, they slowly go down. No shot luck, so I can't use shot lucks. No cure, so I can't use cure. I have battle items turned off because they are data fights and I'm not perfect at the game. No leaks, no form changes, or grand magic, no attractions, no team attacks, which all of that is like, that's free because I can't really use any of that anyway since it's just Sora. Um, I have Koopa coins turned off, and then ability limit. A maximum limit of 30 is placed on abilities you can install on Sora. So let's see what I have. Aerial recovery, payback strike, block, counter slash. <coughs> um, you can only have one of these, and I do counter slash because I don't like impact and counter kick. Yeah, so that's the flash step. Um, I have it equipped. I'm just not very good at it. Um, so yeah, you're right. It takes some set of getting... It's flash step. Um, but yeah, you're right. It takes some getting used to. I used it a couple of times when I was doing like the base game with all Pro Codes playthrough. But I haven't done that since... Last year? Or maybe it was the year before. I haven't done that since... 2020 um so it's been a while 
Uh, I don't know. That's why I'm going through them right now, because I don't know exactly which ones I have on. Um, but since you mentioned it, I'm going through and looking at them to see which ones I have turned on and equipped. Um, I have Aerial Dive. Launch a vertical spinning attack towards a target down below. And then Sweep is the one that goes up above. So I think, I for Zigbar, I probably want Aerial Sweep specifically, because he's always up. I don't really need Aerial Dive, because I don't need to go down. Um, <coughs> if I'm doing a combo, I'm already in, so I don't need triple rush. I always get those two confused. Aerial Dive is what I had on, but for Zigbar, I'm sure I'd probably, yeah, I, I, that's all it comes down to. That's all any of these fights come down to, is learning, like, the timing and the pattern is the blocks. Something else. That's another thing with Shot Lock, and I think you, yeah, 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 yeah. Is that not what Flash Step does? I know what you're talking about. Charge a faraway target while blocking. Oh, I guess not. Yeah, but yeah, no. Oh, Air Step. Air Step. That's what you're talking about. You're talking about Air Step. Um... But yeah, it's the same, th um, I, it, it, yeah, air step, that's what you're talking about. I, I read the description for flash step and got confused, but it's air step. Um, cause you get it in Olympus, like at the very beginning of the game. Um, at least a devastating blow. Your magic stat determines damage. And then I had double flight on for Zemnus. I don't think I need it for Zigbar, though, actually. Yeah, no, no, no. I, I read the description for Flash Step, and because it said Far Away Target, I got confused. Um, but it's Air Step. And I get why, because they both end in Step. Um, but yeah, you're th yeah, it's Air Step. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um scan because I'm a big baby bitch and I want to know how much damage I have left to do. All of the extra combos. <coughs> okay, but I guess for Zigbar I would want aerial sweep rather than dive. Um, because Zigbar is always above me because he's always floating in the air. I don't need to get down to him. I need to get up to him. Um, I guess I can try like working air step into. So it wasn't it because it was also in cage too. Oh uh, yeah 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 yeah. Charge a far away target while blocking. Yeah, I don't understand while blocking. I guess it's a reprisal. Because it's while blocking? Hmm. I'm not sure. But yeah, it's air step. Thank you. Go forward attack with a guard. But how do you... Huh. <coughs> um. Oh, no. I wanted to... So, if I have the same amount of codes turned on, and I do... Um... Zigbar, then I'll get 21,875. So, here, hold on. So, I'm at 205,000. I'm pretty sure I need 365,000. Um, so I just have like a little over a hundred some odd thousand left. So, 365,000. Uh, yes, minus 205,000 is 160 um left and i got 21,875 on zemnus so if i get the same amount because i will get the same amount because that's the amount of pro codes i have turned on um 21,875 then i need to do 7.3 so i would need to do eight more data fights so i don't even have to do all of the ones that are left so I have 11 left. I need to do 8. So there's 3 that I don't have to do. So if I don't want to do Syx and Larxene, that's 2 right there. And then just one other one.
that's not <laughs> terrible, I guess. It could be so much worse. Uh, because I could have to do all of them. <coughs> okay. New. Um, but see, so like, Moko, if you can still see it. So, my strength is 44, and my magic is 37, my defense is 24. They're up right now because of the food boost. Same thing with my HP and my MP. Um, but if I didn't have, uh equipment on if I didn't have food on and if I hadn't been taking like the strength and defense boost items like the the consumable items um they would be zero or like defense would be zero and then strength and magic would be whatever Sora's default at the beginning without anything at all in the game is um so like all of that's weaker and I can't use cure or the grand magic or form changes or anything I can try working air step into my input rotation. I'm just not very, I'm not very good, clearly, at like timing and everything. It's something that I really struggle with. So I don't know if using air step might mess me up because I'm not very good at the technicality inputs. No, 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 they don't. So the only thing, well, I can't show you now, um, but food boosts, as long as the food is active, um, the default st the de food will override default stats, um, strength and defense boosts and magic boosts will override default stats, and gear. Any of your gear that you have will override uh, default stats. The only thing that pro code uh, does not, the only thing that the pro codes uh, negate is strictly what comes from Sora's level. Ruby's a king in this game. <laughs> That's why in the description for the pro code, it specifically says regardless of level. He's too far away! Fuck. Oh, fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. I fucked up. Think fast! Oh, okay. This is the... Alright, sure, 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 sure. Ah, shit. So what do you think? You better run! So that was the difference between aerial sweep and aerial dive! Oh my god, I wasn't paying attention. Gotcha. Oh fuck. Gotcha. Oh, easy peasy opening, oh my god! Default status, your whole team stats are returned to their initial default status regardless of level. And then zero defense. Um, your whole team's defense is set to zero. However, defense boosts from equipment are still applied. 
So food, boost items, and equipment will boost all of your stats, even if these are turned on. You're, but like leveling up to 99, no difference. That doesn't matter. There's no reason to grind to level 99 because it's not going to do you any good. This is bad. Yes. 
bastard. So I can continue and I can save after Zemnis, but then I don't have any health pots. Um, or alternative. So I save my health pots. I can just let him kill me and then continue so that I have my health pots. It's fine. Cool. See, I have all my health pots, and now I can continue. Uh, and I can save. <laughs> and I can buy a Koopa coin. Because <laughs> I forgot. And more health pots. Wait, I don't have any money. I'm going to have to go back into the base game. Because I don't... Oh, I've got... Enough. I have enough to buy a Koopa coin and two health pots. Hey, I got a postcard. <coughs> okay. So you, motherfucker, are done. So, okay, if I can leave three, so I can do one. There's Vendita. This one isn't responding yet. Um, Riku. So I could leave Syax, Larxene. Hmm. I'm just. Hmm. I guess I'll um. I'll go through and I'll like get opinions. Um. It's this file. Yeah, say file five. Okay. Uh. <coughs> Garden doing cage to randos. Well, it's um the cage three rando that's being worked on also uses Garden of Assemblage. Um, but I mean, if you watch like a uh, any uh cage two uh like Jiminy's journal or all. Or like hundred percent speedruns or platinum speedruns, um, they also have to go through yeah. Garden of Assemblage. Uh, but that's where all the data fights are, and it, the same holds true for KH three. Um, but I guess I'll go through, I'll watch fights, I'll get opinions, and I'll see which the what the easiest fights are. Or I guess since I only need to cut out three, what the hardest fights are, and I'll focus on all the ones that are not those. Um, but. I am going to pack it in for the night. So let me find somewhere. I think a KH3 rando race is being done right now. Um, so I can send y'all there. Uh, oh wait, are they done? Did they finish the race? Oh. Okay, well, I'll send you to Ace Lord, um, because he is, what's he doing? I don't know, it doesn't say. There's nothing, Twitch, why aren't you giving me? Oh no, Swift is doing a KH3 render race, so I'll send you to Swift. Um, and you guys enjoy the rest of your night. Please and thank you, and thanks for stopping by. Okay, bye.